Yo, welcome back to another video. It's your boy Marta Don, aka Valley, and you tune into Uptown Valley. Today, I can't. What? Today, I'm coming back with another video. I know I've been gone for like a week or two, sort of to a couple, something like that. But, um, yeah, uh, today's video, I'm gonna be. You already know what happened when I pull out when I pull out a beanie. You already know what happened. Today I'm be turning this beanie into a ski mask, but as from the last ones, something you never seen. As in, I just keep doing different ones. It's not the same or whatever like that. I'm trying to make this quick, so let me like wrap this up. But um, I'm gonna be turning this into a ski mask, and I'm not gonna be sewing it today. I'm gonna be gluing it. I know people don't know how to sew, so and don't got a sewing machine or whatever like that. So, and anybody could just go and buy glue. And if you don't know how to glue, then I don't know what's up with you. You need to go do something with your life or something. But um, yeah, we're gonna be gluing this today, and I'm gonna catch you in the next clip. All right. So what you want to do is mark where your eyes is at, like the usual. If you've seen the other videos, then you should know how this goes. Um, but yeah. You just want to cut where your eyes going to be at and then you want to get to the mouth section and you want to cut where your mouth is going to be at. You are know the vibes. All right, so now what you want to do is get the hot glue sticks. You get these at Walmart. They're like a dollar to two dollars cheap, real cheap. And then this hot glue gun, which was also cheap like two dollars three dollars if you don't got that then um i don't know what to tell you my boy but you could still use other um glues to do this but this is the glue that i use because this one is effective it's hot glue and it's just like good for glue and stuff i guess but yeah just do that and then what you want to do is hot like when you cut through it there's two layers as you can see there's two layers what you want to do is hot glue the top part top layer and then fold over the bottom layer on top of that to create this lip to conceal it so it could have that look onto it as you can see if you can't see that then um my apologies i guess but like what i'm looking at you can clearly see it or whatever like that so you should be able to know how to do it all right once you finish doing the eye part what you want to do is go down to the mouth part and get do the same thing you did with the top i mean with the um eye part you just want to hot glue it um and then flip over that bottom layer close it you know as you've seen with the eye parts the same thing All right, when you're done, you just want to clean it up on the inside so you won't have no extra glue or won't poke you or anything like that. All right, now we're back to the eye part. If you've seen a ski mask before, well, some ski masks is like that. It has the mouth part, then it has the eye opening where it's just like one opening, but we're gonna turn this one opening into two. So what you wanna do is go to the center of the eye opening of the mask, and then you just wanna hot glue it together. And I felt like the hot glue wasn't enough. So like I hot glued it and then put some material in between there like a thin spot so it won't be all the way on it or whatever like that but just enough to be like that as you can see just so it could turn out like that and then you just want to let it sit and dry up and get all firm and it should stay like that and if it if it comes apart you can just hot glue it back together or whatever like that simple right exactly so run my likes my comments and my subscribes my views and all that share it and all that you already know the vibes but 
this last part, I'm just adding the puff paint to put the signature V on there because Uptown Valley Valley, you know, you are new. All right, we are finally done with the um, mask. It was very quick, very easy. But this is the next day because, like, I decided to do that at, like, 11-something that night. And, like, I won't going to do the end of the video then because um, on here, because that, that puff paint, it had to dry, whatever, like that. And if I touch it or move it or anything like that, it's just going to mess up. So I didn't want to do that until the next day. So this is what it looks like. Hopefully this is in frame because I can't see myself right now, but that's what it looked like. In personal opinion, it actually came out nice because like for it to be have glued, like for me to have glued it, like I didn't expect it to come out like this for real, for real. And because it's a small beanie and it looked bigger online, but in person it's pretty small. Plus I got my hair like this. Um, I might add a clip of me wearing it but like it's not fully on like a regular ski mask but it still looks good and all that but um yeah this is the end of the video look at that like comment and subscribe follow me on instagram and you already know the vibes um give me to 800 subscribers uh but you know i'm not posting this until i get 800 subscribers so give me to 900 subscribers but um i'm gonna catch y'all in the next video all right all right, so this how it came out. This how it look right here. Personally, it might be better than the song one because this one looked cleaner. And just like, I don't know. It just looked more like a ski mask. But yeah, like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram.